But you gotta realize yeah. what Trey did. Like Trey was one every time oh, something no, go wrong, bad, whatever. It. This nigga was there. He's in the boat. But then too, the, the hospitality as well. Oh, down in the south for sure. He gonna get your flight. He gonna yeah. get your rooms. He oh, gonna, he gonna do it. all that. He gonna do all that. I don't know no nigga in LA that's gonna do that. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk. But that's because I know how to move with the times. Some people don't know how to move with the times. Some people are afraid to move with the times too. They like things the way they is. Yeah. And this is book too. Some free game for y'all. It's called, um, my homie Kenny Hamilton gave it to me. It's called Who Moved My Cheese? Wow. Who Moved My Cheese? Yeah. So, read that. Text me that, please. Yeah. Who Moved My Cheese? And, you know, to give you a brief summary, it, it tells you the characteristics about people. So, they got like two mice and they got two little people. Mm. And the mice, them the ones that, you know, they don't get comfortable. The cheese is there. When the cheese is gone, they don't complain about they just go get some, they go to look for some more cheese. The little people, they the ones that's like, damn, what happened to the cheese? They depressed over the cheese. I don't want your cheese to stay this way. I don't want to do this. The whole time they complaining, the mice already found some more cheese. Mm -hmm. You know wow. what I'm saying? It's all, it's so real. you got to get in that mindset of, hey, when shit, shit is not going to stay the same forever. You have to be able to, all right, when you see something changing, Get right ahead of that. Go look for that next bag and continue to move. So, yeah. That's all. I'll be on my books, my audio gotta, books and everything. Gotta, Get that audio knowledge. You got to read. Yeah. Hey, a P once told me, man, old legendary P once told me, he said, man, listen, man, don't worry about one running off, man. The time you worry about running off, the one that's running off, man, you could be trying to find another one, man. Facts. Straight up. Same, that's real. same game. Same that's real. Same thing. Focus. Mm -hmm. Where's your focus? All right? Mm -hmm. So, when you do this project, do how many how many visuals do we get with it? I ask everybody this question. Mm -hmm. That's one of my main questions. Bro, it ain't no limit to visuals because now you're doing all types of shit. You're doing shorts and you're doing all type of little yeah, them shorts. What you call them the the the, uh, the um TikTok TikTok little little stuff reels so, reels. You're doing everything, homie. So I just try to do as much and get as much content as I can get. I don't do a whole lot of stuff, you know what I'm saying, as much as I should. Mm -hmm. Most of my fan base they just rocking with me, you know what I'm saying. I don't have no big giant fan base. But the ones that I have across the country and even some out the country, they really lock in with me. You know what I mean? Is it in? So it, I don't be doing the whole bunch, but maybe this time I'll do a little extra shit. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Is. Is it, con yeah. Content is king. Yeah. Is it, I, I'm, I'm old school, so I like tangible items. You know, if you do a project, you know, I'm, I'm going to pull up on you and buy. But the merch, though? Uh, you know, I'm going to buy something from you. The merch, yeah. I'm going to make the fly shit for you to have that's going to go along with the project. And not even just clothes, just all type of shit that you, you know, supplies that you use every day. I yeah, make all yeah. That shit. Yeah, I done made everything with my merch from from skateboards to low riders to goddamn. I had a remote. When control. the project come out? This one right now. I no, got no, I'm saying pieces. when the project yeah, come out, you yeah. got pieces that really Skateboard. ride with that. Hell yeah, I that's all. That's all. Me and my group, Strong Arm Steady, we even did a drop with um with um with um with Diamond Diamond Supply. Like I done did a few. Yeah, flags. yeah. Shout out Diamond Supply. They, are they still around? Still doing their thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cause they, you know I used to sell it a lot. It was hot there for a second. Oh, you know yeah. these brands come and go. Yeah, you some know? do, some don't. Trade the truth. He always do his um, listening parties there. Oh really? Yeah, yeah. Diamond Supply for sure, for sure. Shout out yeah. to my brother Trey, to Trey too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Did, how, you been on the trade day? Come on, man. Yeah. You 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 also y'all rock that trade. I hadn't been to one. And I'm man, in Texas. He had a he had a camel. Out I talked there. to him on the phone, but I, I was like, I, I, I love what he doing. Parties at South by Southwest too. Trey opened up one of them boombox stores in Dago, and we we did a little yeah. a little drop down there. He I, gave I, me I, a dope. I went out there in Texas. He gave me some boom boxes. Right. Oh yeah. Yeah. I met a lot of people down there for trade day when I interviewed you, right? And I would just, I just come down the, the first The first time I went, that's where I first met like DC Young Fly. I first was that met that Wallow. Year? I seen you down there, homie. Yep. That was that year? Yeah. Remember Slim Fo was with us? Slim Fo was that year? That was the year. Yeah. No, I that was South By. I thought, you, I thought you was talking about South By South. No, no, that was South By. Trade Day. Yeah. South wow. by Southwest. I used to go there every year too. That is crazy. Shout out to the homie Lil Boss, man. Yeah, that Boss. A and NK mm -hmm. Tun. Yeah, that. They're my niggas. Oh, man. That, that's, it's crazy how, how you go. You got people that's getting they do they have guys y'all got days out here anybody got the something going to where I'm asking now it's crazy that you said it because no we why don't not like, we don't like each other that much out here uh -huh. so y'all ain't nobody showing no love at the park like hey let's come down here and do this nah. for your day that's a different they have they have never certain, certain people have certain days but it's more like towards the community 
It okay. ain't like no how Trey got everybody coming together. You got to think about it. You know, I got to, you know what? Matter of fact, I got to give a shout out to Mr. Hey. Fab. Okay. Mr. Fab just had Mr. Fab week. Yeah. I was just out there in the Bay. It was a whole so week a thing out there in the Bay. Wow. So yeah, he got that. He got that out there. It ain't nobody really in uh, LA that got that. I know they ain't got one a day go on. But you got to realize yeah. what Trey did. Like, Trey was one every time oh, something no, go wrong, bad, whatever. It. This nigga was there. He's in the boat. But then, too, the, the hospitality as well. Oh, down in the south for sure. He going to get your flight. He going to yeah. get your rooms. He oh, gonna he going to do it. all that. He going to do all that. I don't know no nigga in L.A. that's going to do that. We got to start somewhere. We get got to. Get about four home. niggas in the room. Yeah, right. you see what I'm saying? It start you can't be before. done, and just bring a few in, bring a few, and and try. You know what I mean? Because even even Lil Kiki got seven one three day, like that's his day mm -hmm. seven one three. Like all of them got things going. You know what I mean? That's I think big. That, that's big, man. And the Houston got a way that they do things, man. That's a little bit different than others. Hey, would you want? Hey, would you want an AD day, homie? That'll be hard, huh? honestly. Yeah. That'll be no. hard. You know why I asked you that? Why? Because I wouldn't want one neither. That's why. I why? Asked that. <laughs> why would you want a day? You want to know why? Man. I got too many. I got too many homies. Yeah, from all different places and walks in life. Mm. And you cut it off. Okay. Too many homies from all different walks of life. Mm -hmm. That eventually, that should have go bad. Really? And I wouldn't want yeah. nothing bad put on my name with with that. Exactly. But you gotta understand, man. You, I see how you looking at it, but it's a build up. It's a build up, but, but I mean, well, it, it don't start off like Trey didn't just start off with Trey Day and it was just good. Yeah, but our game ain't politics. Off, it was some floods. It was some all kind yes. of stuff, bro. It's been some things that happen out here, some key moments, and as you grow. Yes, yeah, so people still you. gonna get killed. I hear people you. still gonna die. But our politics is different out here. Like our game bay politics. Did you hear is what I just said? I know people gonna die. They gonna die anyway. They gonna die. But to me, that's one of the biggest stigmas with California, is that we're held back. And I, I literally just talked about this on my show. I told I told certain you know members in the room, Bloods and Crips. I said, would you do a business with your direct enemy? And everybody's like, hmm. Half of it is no. Have it is like, uh, that's what you're going to have to deal with every time. Every single time you're going to have to deal with that. Yeah. Well, I still say we got to start somewhere. We do. It helps we our do. people. I don't care. It, 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 I, I, I get it. I'm not from here. I don't know what it's going to take. But if you could just get one, if you could save one, that's the way I look at it. You know what I'm saying? And you guys are very, you know, influential. So, mm -hmm. Just to come together when you oh you will come together and get that bag. Mm -hmm. Even then, you, you still you come together look, and get that bag. Like minded individuals, people Everybody come to your show. They support you. They come to watch you. They, you got a lot of fans out here. Facts. You got a lot of people watching you. It's a lot of people that you influence. We don't know what can happen. But e, I'm one of them few that is is mind is elevated. You know what I mean? I'm not looking at stuff like that. You know what I mean? This is my big bro. He's a blood. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I come from where I come from. I don't see no color lines. It's just nothing but respect. Everybody don't move like that. And that's why somebody like me could be in the position that he's in. You can't have that same mentality and think you about to continue to move up in these ranks like that. You're going to crash out You're every putting time. yourself out there. And the thing is, it's like this. Yeah. 99.9% .9 everybody might be with whatever you got mm -hmm. going on. But when you got to think about coming home to your family every night and to your kids, is it really worth it to be able to say, I'm, 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 I'm knowing that I'm going to step out here and that 0.01% ain't going to be that one motherfucker that don't like what's going on today. And now either I got to do something to him, he got to do something to me. These type of events like that, and just to bring all that there and put my face in the front of that. It'd be too much hatred and shit. And I hate to say that, homie, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't want it to be like that. I want us to I want us to get money together the same way. But and, and me and the homie can do that. I know. But it, it I'm saying as a whole, it can happen. I mean, not as a whole, it can happen. At, between me and him, it can, it can happen. happen. But it always takes it only takes that one individual, homie, to shock away the whole the whole. And mission. we can we can sanction you know what I'm saying? Because it's it's all about respect. We can sanction what we're doing mm -hmm. and bring people in little by little. Mm -hmm. But if we just have a, uh, we doing a Missy Slick day. You know what I mean? The police ain't gonna let that happen. It's just slick. 
<laughs> Did you sleep that? Oh, Look, shit. You ain't want to go to your own shit. Nah, I don't want to go to that shit. <laughs> you ain't going? Hell no, nah, I ain't what going to do that. Do? Okay, we do a Mitch's Slick Day right. in Vegas. Right. Oh, we in Vegas, we gotta change. Yeah, it. you can do it. Vegas. Vegas. Go up though. <laughs> Mitch Slick Day. Hey, I lived in Vegas for ten years. See what I'm saying? I told them streets up, man, yeah. for a long time. You know, time. property is not owned in its own country. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You might have to do it. You had to come to Dallas and do it. Do 80 day in Dallas? Yeah, you gotta do I'll something. I'll do that. Go up. Yeah, but it's gonna come right back home. People mm-hmm. gonna be like, man, that ain't gonna. Man, when you gonna do it out here? It's gonna come back. It's gonna blow up. Yeah, AD, you, 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 you go ahead, man. I think you need to try that, AD, man. Nobody want to be, be on it, homie. You know what? Yeah. Right in Compton, homie. Right, <laughs> right over there, homie. It ain't happening. But right. you gotta think about it. It's because you gotta realize, man, y'all, man, it's, it's hard, man. You, you know, Martin Luther King, people, a leader, it's tough. You know, uh, uh, you know, a good shepherd is willing to die for his sheep. Mm-hmm. You see what I'm saying? It's a tough thing to be a leader, bro. I think I was meant to live for my shit. Like, yeah. You know, I think, I think, I think. I agree with I, you on that one. Different, different one for me, man. You ain't going out like that. No. <laughs> yeah, man, I done sat down and talked this out plenty of times. No, I think, I think, I think God want me to stay out here, man. Yeah, that's, well, you being yeah, out here definitely makes a difference. Shit, homie. That's real. That's yeah. real, man. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.